We were shooting that opening scene where, uh, one of the opening scenes where the cave is at the other end of the, uh, of the bridge leading to the, to the, uh, to Sheehan's and he lights a cigar and, and that light is the brightest thing in the, in the, in the scene. And, uh, it was quite a beautiful shot and we, we were setting up to shoot that and waiting until the light got just right. And we had, we had time literally to shoot two of them. And, uh, uh, Stanley Kubrick called me, uh, from London, uh, afterwards, after the film was, when it was released over there. And he said, Stanley likes to talk on the telephone a lot. He said, how'd you, uh, how'd you get that shot where, where, where uh, McCabe is on lighting a cigar? I said, well, we just waited till the kind of the end of the day. And when they went, he said, yeah, but when, after you shot it, how did you know it was good? I said, well, uh, we didn't. I just, uh, he said, well, who's, who, who's the camera? In the I said, actually, I shot that because I remember Villamush had to go fly back to L.A. for a, a early a day and we were coming up to a weekend. So he set it up and, and we just waited and shot it. He said, but how'd you know you got it? I said, I just assumed that we did. And, and uh, he, he, he had a hard time understanding because Danny really liked it. He was very, very precise about things and he wanted it to be exactly proper. For a manger. He was just some Joseph looking for a manger.